The event was on the water, but the ripple effect has been widespread. Photos and video of an annual charity event called Sandbar Bash on Lake Butamore surfaced on social media, showing what appeared to be hundreds of people with little or no social distancing. And that's making waves with some people here. It's just a law of averages, right? I mean, somebody there is going to get it, or they already had it, and they're spreading it around. Joel Bender had the lake almost to himself on Monday, but says his father and son both witnessed the massive crowds on Saturday, a day that he noted also marked the start of Governor Evers' mask mandate. There's a mask mandate. They're trying their best to figure out back to school and how the Packers are going to play. And it's like, that ah, screw everybody. Let's go have a thousand person boat party. The annual event staged to raise funds for the Old Glory Honor Flight was reportedly set up through the organizers Facebook page, which since appears to have been taken down. The Winnebago County Sheriff's Office tells our sister station in Green Bay that it was on a lake outdoors, so it's not aware of any violations of the mask order. We also reached out to the local health department. In a statement to 12 News, the county health officer encouraged anyone who has attended a gathering or event where actions were not taken to prevent the spread of COVID-19 to monitor for symptoms and limit contact with others for 14 days. Guillermo Zapata lives near the lake and cares for an elderly health compromised relative. People are being that irresponsible. You know, they're not just endangering themselves, they're endangering the whole community. Near Oshkosh, I'm Kent Wainscott, WISN 12 News. Masks are not mandated on lakes, but the Winnebago County Health Officer says masks and social distancing are critical to reducing the spread of the virus.